Upon returning from his triumphant win of the European Arnold Classic in Spain, Victor Martinez was detained by immigration for a review of some legal problems from his past. Ten days after his release, Victor answers some of the questions fans have been wanting to know. For the past seven months, a day, um, you, you, you have to remember, um, you, you're pretty much restricted to very, very low calorie meals. The, uh, the calories you would consider will be, um, I, I think babies have more calories than what I was getting in there. Now, to show you the difference, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm going inside with 8,000 calories per day in my regimen, in my meal plans. Now, I'm inside and now I'm being restricted to 800 calories a day. And this is the equivalent of, again, this is the equivalent of most, of most people, or at least some bodybuilders, 800 calorie meal, or just single meal. And I'm having this for an entire day. And out of those 800 calories, I think a Snickers was about, you know, 300 of those calories. I had a decision to make while I was in there. So it was, you know, continue eating, eat more of the same calories, but then you have to remember the, the, the fat carb ratio was, and the protein ratio was way off. I mean, the carbohydrates, eating about uh, two, 300 grams of carbs and protein was probably about 10 to 15 grams. And it just, it got to a point that I knew if I kept on trying to eat more just to sustain my weight, well, what would happen since there are no weights, there is no yard, so everything is definitely uh, out of the question. I mean, you can't, it's not like you can just go follow a gym regimen in there. I mean, there's so many push-ups and, and sit-ups and chin-ups that you can do. So I decided, you know what, before I eat all these carbs and lay dormant and get fat and come out and just have this new battle of burning fat now and, and trying to build muscle, that, that would have been a whole new different challenge. So I resorted to eating just enough to get by the day, enough to get me through my push-ups and chin-ups, a small routine that I would do about 20, 15 to 20 sets per day, and uh, sometimes every other day. And just, again, just try to upkeep myself, just movement so I won't uh, have too much muscle atrophy. To stay um, inside and be positive, it's, it's, it's a combination of different things and, and the combination, again, as I um, would not ever uh, stop mentioning to anyone, combinations was the fans, friends, family, the magazine, um, Muscular Development, I mean, just reading uh, feedback from everyone, and Maximum Human Performance, MHP, the support from the staff. I mean, everybody was out here, again, just big Christmas party, and, and just receiving the uh, letter and the, the card from everyone here was, uh, that, that's all motivating. And you don't really want to just get yourself consumed at the moment. So what I chose to consume myself was uh, with um, what would I do as soon as I leave this place. And, and that's what I was mostly thinking about. What would I do? Uh, how would I do it next time? And how would I step into the gym? How would I approach it now? Now, again, these are all things that I combine with 20 years of working out already. So I'm combining the best of what I learned to start all over, to start all over, but to start right. Again, you know, how I got injured before, how to avoid the injury, how uh, the training, the food, the supplements, just combining everything all at once and thinking the best way I will come out, step into the gym and make the best game possible.
A lot of the fans outpouring was that they, they were actually writing uh, to me. They were writing uh, handwritten mails. Uh, e um, they were basically uh, typing anything, but definitely the letters. The, the letters, the books I was receiving from them, motivational books, and um, it, it, it was just every single letter I've I prob I probably read every single letter, a total of, uh, I would have to say, no less than uh, six times each, or seven, you know. I know there was one in particular that I read it ten times that was by this young girl named Sierra. She's from Pennsylvania, and she basically um, has been following me in the sport of bodybuilding since the age of six. And now, when I come out, uh, she's 11 now. Now, you, you have to imagine, you know, she's been brought to all the bodybuilding shows by her father. I, I think she, she's had every single 8x10 that I've produced, because I always uh, decided, let me give her one. And, and look, now she's a grown young girl, and she, that, that letter, I mean, just it kept me going. It kept me going, so the power of, of that communication that you will get from a fan and again, what I consider fans are friends that I haven't met yet, and and that was uh, something that that really touched me, and um, it, it was it was pretty strong and motivating, and and that's what kept me going. Some of the uh, guards in there, they they were big fans, and and people that were in there, and 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 it was just every day, every day. There was not one single day that somebody would say, you know, you don't belong here, and and you know, you'll be out too. The first time I walked back into the gym was, uh, I mean, I would have to say the first time I walked into the gym when I was 16. And again, except this time I knew exactly what machine was for what body part. I knew, I knew that this time around, but just taking control of the weight and getting that mind-muscle connection. So that mind-muscle connection was something that took me back to when I first stepped into the gym when I was 16 and, and now. And the weights were heavy. I'm too focused on the weight being heavy, and I should have been focused up in my feeling the muscle by me holding on to this weight. And it took about a few minutes. It took maybe about 15, 20 minutes instead of just curling the way and just pressing the way I said, you know what, let me let me get back in the groove. I know the intimidation was set by how much am I going to lift instead of how much will I feel. And once I made that interaction within myself, it pretty much took off from there. And and again, I'm not saying I'm in full blast right now. This is uh, first week. I'm sore as hell. The soreness, it, it's it's unbearable, but this is what I always strive for, that, that soreness. That soreness gives you that indication that you are, you're back into training, that you're, you're back into building muscle. And, and in order for me to get help to build that muscle, which makes me so happy uh, at this point, is to be introduced to a new product MHB just came out with, uh, MyOX. Not only is MyOX a, a, a great muscle builder, but it's a uh, myostatin inhibitor. And it, I mean, just coming out and being welcomed just by this new product, I am I'm so happy and excited. I'm just right now flooding my body with, with, with these supplements. Again, slowly but surely. And I'm taking the, the minimum dose of everything right now. Again, you being with the Activite, you know, I'm taking probably about two tablets, uh, you know, BCAAs. Again, you know, at minimum, I'm doing about right now two shakes a day when I, I was used to doing three. And uh, w once I combine everything, I know my recovery is going to be much sooner than three, four days as it is now. Yes, the transformation is going to be interesting. Even I, um, who pretty much possess the body, it's going to be interesting to kind of see the different changes that's going to occur every single day and every single week and month to month. And it's just going to be, it's going to be amazing just watching it. And uh, I'm definitely going to share this with all my fans out there. 
and I can't wait because uh, it's going to be very interesting. This is I haven't been 220 pounds since I became pro, uh, you know, 12 years ago. So that's going to be something uh, very interesting to watch. Actually letting your body go through a rest and, 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 and the rest most people think is not needed. Uh, we, when we out here, we're always going to the gym, we're always training, resting and staying away from the gym. After a while, it actually becomes a, a, a kind of an addiction. You cannot be out of the gym longer than a week or two. And to actually take a month or two off that you actually do need, that will actually will help you psychologically does not set in in your mind and it, it's impossible. You'll never do that. Now, unfortunately, my break was forced on me, and but I find a blessing in disguise. And just to see this now, again, from, from resting, letting my body rest, you know, zero supplements, I mean, very low calories on food, and, and the muscle just recovering and recovering and so much recovering. And so now getting back and, and Putting everything together, my training regimen, my meal plan, my supplementation, and all at, all at once, and getting into the gym, it's going to be, uh, again, as I keep saying, it's going to be something very interesting to watch, and, and you all will enjoy it. Yes, we ha I have taken some before pictures, and you'll be shocked when you see them. And... I just, is that me? <laughs> you know, uh, I told my little brother, it's like he could have filled in for me for that picture because, uh, I mean, even he looks huge to me right now. I'm here basically starting all over again. As you can see, this, you're not looking at the old Victor Martinez. This is a new Victor Martinez again, and I'm looking at building some major muscle. MHP has come out with a new product, Myo X, and that is the great thing about MHP, and, and they're just innovators when it comes to products, and I'm so happy to be introduced to this new product because it's a myostatin inhibitor, and right now, I'm in need of real big muscle building products, and this is one of them, a new muscle building product that's gonna change the, the whole look that I'm gonna need to step on that stage very soon. Now, combining it with dark matter and Activite and up your mass is definitely going to take my body up to the level that I need to be. Again, I, I'm very excited to try this new product. I'm psyched. I'm getting into the gym this coming week and combining all of it with this stack is going to take me to a whole new level and I can't wait to use it. And when you see the transformation that my body has gone through, you too are going to want to use it and I will be the first one to show you the effects of the true new product from MHP, Myo X. Follow along with updates on Victor's transformation and his return to the competitive stage by signing up at MHPStrong.com.